friends. My name is M. Lubna and I am from a little teacher from Chittur Olympiad branch. So today I am here to say a very interesting topic to you. So before entering into the topic, let me ask a question. If you are given with a quadratic equation, you will solve the equation and you will get the roots. By the help of uh, roots, can you get the quadratic equation? If yes, how? If no, why? So today, let me answer to this question. So to answer to this question, first you want to know the relationship between roots and qua coefficients of quadratic equation. What is quadratic equation? A quadratic equation seems, by name we can understand, quadratic means 2. So the quadratic equation general form is ax square plus bx plus c is equals to 0. Where a, b, c must belong to real numbers and a not equals to 0. Why we say a not equals to 0? Why? Because if a is equals to 0, 0 into x square, it becomes 0. So we will be left over with bx plus c. It's not a quadratic equation. So they say that a is not equals to 0. So quadratic equation, degree is 2. So we will have two roots. So the two roots, let me think alpha and beta. So first, let me think alpha as minus b plus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a and beta minus b minus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a. So let me find first sum of the roots and next product of the roots. So sum of the roots is nothing but we are going to add the both. So minus b plus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a plus minus b minus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a. So now here you can see minus b, LCM is 2 by a. So minus b minus b minus 2b plus root of b square minus 4ac minus root of b square minus 4ac get cancelled. So minus 2b by 2a. 2, 2 get cancelled. We will be left over with minus b by a. So the sum of the roots is minus b by a. No product of the roots. Multiplying the both. Minus b plus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a into minus b minus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a. You know the formula, right? a plus b into a minus b is equals to a square minus u b square. So use the formula here. a plus b into a minus b. a square means minus b whole square minus root of b square minus 4ac whole square by 2a into 2a, 2a whole square. So minus b square, square of negative is always positive, right? So you will be left over with b square minus root of b square minus 4ac. Root square get cancelled. So b minus b plus 4ac. So minus b square plus b square get cancelled and down 2a square which is nothing but 4a square. You will be left over with 4ac by 4a square. 4, 4 get cancelled. 1a in the numerator, 1a in the denominator get cancelled and you will be left over by c by a. Now sum of the roots is minus b by a, product of the roots is c by a. So entering into our topic, formation of quadratic equation using roots. So I know I told the general form of quadratic equation is ax square plus bx plus c is equals to 0. Now divide total equation by a, ax square by a, bx by a, c by a. So a, a get cancelled x square plus b by a x plus c by a. Now here let me use a small example to explain you in a better way. So how will you write plus 2? So plus 2 can be written as minus of minus 2 in the same way. Plus b by a can be written as minus of minus b by a. So x square minus of minus b by a into x plus c by a. We know minus b by a is sum of the roots and c by a is product of the roots. So x square minus sum of the roots into x plus product of the roots. So now I have explained you how we will get a quadratic equation using roots. So let me use some, give more example. So first let me think the roots are 3 comma minus 2 for an equation. So first think of product of the roots sum of the roots. 3 plus of minus 2. So 3 minus 2. So it's nothing but 1. So sum of the roots is 1. Product of the roots. 3 into 2. 3 into 2? 6. But here we are having minus 2. So you will get minus 6. So what I told x square minus of sum of the roots. So minus of 1 into x my plus product of the roots. So we will we'll get the quadratic equation as x square minus x minus 6. If you have doubt uh, on this, so you can again factorize the given quadratic equation, you will get the same roots. So let me take some uh, conjugate roots. So one is 2 plus root 3, another one is 2 minus root 3. 
Now first sum of the roots, alpha, uh, alpha plus beta, 2 plus root 3 plus 2 minus root 3, root 3, root 3 get cancelled, 2 plus 2, 4, sum of the roots is 4, product of the roots, 2 plus root 3 into 2 minus root 3, again the formula a plus b into a minus b. So 2 plus 3 into 2 minus 3, 2 square minus root 3 whole square, 2 square is 4, minus root 3 whole square is 3, 4 minus 3 is 1, so the equation is x square minus sum of the roots is 4. So 4x plus product of the roots is 1. So the equation is x square minus 4x plus 1. So friends, in this video you have understood that how to get a quadratic equation using roots. Thank you for giving me this wonderful opportunity.